just clicking this video. My name is Maciel, just in case it's your first time on my channel. And today it is Thursday the 11th. I'm leaving to Las Vegas in a couple of hours, and so I wanted to film a pack with me video. I had all my outfits planned, all my stuff planned, but I just wanted to show you guys the process and how I organize for my luggage, my carry-on, and my makeup bag. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and let's get straight to it. I'm going to start out with my makeup bag. Um, this one is from Pixie Beauty, but you can get one anywhere, Amazon, Target, Walmart, you name it, they probably have it. I like this one because it has three compartments, so I have this space, this space, and this little pouch. So I'm going to start off with this side. I'm going to utilize it for makeup. I don't ever like to overpack makeup because typically on vacation, I just do my brows and lashes and I'm on the go, but I am going to a wedding, so I'm going to take my Morphe and Bretman Rock Highlight Palette. I'm going to put that at the bottom over here. I'm going to take my Juvia's Place and the Nubian palette. I like this because it has the neutral, still like a natural look if I want to go for that. And then lastly, the Give It To Me Straight palette by ColourPop. Again, natural and neutral tones, something I could do every day if I decide to wear makeup. So I'll just put that in the corner right there. And then I have my foundation, which is the Fit Me Foundation by Maybelline. I have a primer by e.l.f. right here. I have a concealer, and this is by Fit Me again. I'm taking three lip products, different colors. This one's like a nude lip gloss, a pink kind of lavender lip tone, and then I have a red lip satin. So I'm just going to put those all in here as well. And then... I have my makeup brushes. I separate it into two and wrap it around with hair bands just to cut on um, save space. So I'll leave that over here. There we go. Now in this top pouch, I'm going to put like my face wash and body wash. Um, I do have to go to Walmart later and grab like the little containers so that I could put my shampoo and body wash. But for now, I just wanted to film this for you guys. So I have my Castile soap. Put that up here. That's my everyday face wash. Um... I have my under eye pads. I like to use these in the morning. It makes me look a little more awake. I have my makeup fixing spray. I kind of put that up here since it's a spray. My pixie oil. I use this as a moisturizer, so definitely need that. And then I'm taking this pixie essence as a backup for nighttime moisturization. I always need contact solution. I'm taking my jade roller in for the morning. And then, like I said, I still have to go and get the little containers for my shampoo and body wash. So that'll definitely go in here. And then lastly, so then this last pouch, I already have cotton swabs in here. I need to go to Walmart and buy cotton rounds. And then lastly, I'm just going to throw my face towel in here. And there we go. We are all set and packed for makeup. For my carry-on, I like to use a book bag. Sometimes I'll use kind of like a satchel or a giant gym bag. But um, for longer trips, I like to use a book bag because it serves kind of like extra um, storage if you can't fit everything into your luggage. So this book bag has two different compartments. And I'll put the smaller stuff in here and then my laptop and all the bigger stuff back here. First things first, on the top, there's like this little pouch and in there, I put this even smaller pouch and what it holds are my two different um, headphones. So this one has like the iPhone jack at the bottom and then on the plane if I want to watch a movie, inside of here I have headphones with the regular jack. So I'm just going to put that in this small pouch. Travel, I like to always carry a book and I'm currently reading How to Be an Overnight Success. So I'm going to put that in the front pouch. I have a four hour flight today, so this probably will serve handy. And if there's any downtime during the trip, I like to read. Everywhere I go, I always carry a journal. Um, this journal specifically is where I write all my YouTube notes and any extra notes for um, the magazine that I own. So I'm definitely going to be carrying my journal. So besides my actual um, vlogging and filming camera, I like to have an actual Polaroid um, just to like take little quick photos throughout the trip. So I'm going to put that in the front as well.
I have a portable charger just in case my phone dies. And then we have my wallet. So this will probably be the last thing that I put in the front. And um, yeah, so there's everything, some money. I'm actually bringing some of my magazine stickers to see if I could stick them around the city. And then I have like my credit cards and all that important stuff back here. Last thing would be my phone that I would put in the front, but I still need it right now. But anyways, it would go in the front pouch. Here, I always carry my laptop. I like to edit during my downtime or if um, I'm still finishing up my spring semester. So if I have time to catch up on school during my downtime, this will be convenient. And on the airport, in the airport, I like to watch movies. So this is going in the laptop pouch. Charger, that's gonna go in the back as well small makeup bag i have a bigger one that i put in my luggage with all like my foundations brushes and all my like face washes camera charger um, for the battery just in case my camera dies while i'm at the airport i can just charge it up well first if you have any bigger shoes carry it in your carry-on just in case it adds weight to your bigger luggage and you don't want to go over the, i think it's like 50 pound limit but um, i'm leaving my on my trip like, I'm going to wear Vans on the airplane, but in case I want to get more comfortable, I'm going to carry a pair of slides. And during the trip, I'm sure I'll be wearing these a lot. So I'm just going to pop these in there. So that fits everything in my carry-on. And then the last thing are my sunglasses. So my sunglasses look like this. It came with a little safety pouch and i think i'm just gonna put that in the top pouch with my headphones just so that they're safe so that is it everything in my carry-on um i always prefer using a book bag like i said because it's super spacious and if there's anything that um you need to take out of your luggage to hit that 50 pound limit i just fit it and throw it in this book bag so that's my carry-on so the final thing that I want to show you guys is our luggage. Um, as you can see, it's split in half. Um, me and Tay, typically when we go on vacation together, we just share a luggage. So this is his half and then this is mine. The only challenge with that is that we try to stay under 50 pounds so that we don't have to pay the fee when it's over 50 pounds. Typically, we're right at the cusp. So we usually do a really good job. And this time around, like I'm not really packing too much. But I'm just going to show you guys how I do my luggage. So first things first, I always do shoes at the bottom. Um, I'm taking three pairs of shoes in here. So I have my Converse. These are really dirty. And the reason I'm taking these is because we're going to do kind of like a dune buggy tour um, tomorrow. And so inside of the shoes, I, like when it's a sneaker, I always leave the socks inside. That way when I get dressed, I just have them ready to go. So I'm just going to put that at the bottom. And then I'm also taking a pair of loafers. These are just going to be kind of like my stylish shoes. So I'm going to leave these at the bottom. And then I'm taking a pair of sandals. So these are just going to go right here. I do also have to fit a pair of heels in here. I'm going to try and purchase some before we leave today. But um, that will just go on top if anything. Um, so then what I do, if I have any extra small purses, I'll put that over since it's flat. And I'm taking a fanny pack. And I'm also taking this small, like, clutch. I'm just going to leave that at the bottom. So now I'm going to pack by outfits. Um, so when packing my luggage, I always make a list on my phone of all my outfits. That way I'm just organized. And the same thing goes on for my carry-on and for my makeup bag. I just make lists to make sure I have everything that I need. Um, and when I pack, I like to roll things up to conserve space. So you'll see how I do that. First thing I'm going to put in here are my pajamas that I'm going to wear every night. So I'm just going to wear these um, pajama shorts. And then this t-shirt. And I just roll it up within each other. So that's going to go right there. Um, uh, for my dune buggy experience, I'm going to wear high-waisted leggings and a sports bra and a t-shirt right here um just in case it gets hot i can take off the t-shirt and just be in the sports bra so let me see i'm gonna wrap the sports bra in there another outfit this is a pair of high-waisted leggings and this really nice satin blouse i'm gonna pair this with my loafers so i'm just gonna roll that up
actually my favorite outfit that I'm taking. It's a pair of um, high-waisted denim shorts from Boohoo. And then this like cropped off the shoulder top. It's white and it's from Romway. Uh, I just fold it. There we go. So I'm also taking an extra outfit just to be safe. This is a pair of jeans. Um, I have a striped blouse and then a striped crop shirt. We'll see what I decide to wear. I'll probably pair those with the sandals. I want to take a belt just in case I need one. And the last thing that will go on top is my makeup bag. So it's pretty convenient since it has so many compartments. Just close that. And then we just strap this up, tighten it a little bit, and boom, everything fits in there. <laughs> now, if it was just a trip by myself, I'd probably take a carry-on. Um, I think I could fit everything in a carry-on. But we managed to fit everything in this luggage. So that is it for this video, guys. I got everything packed. Now I have to go get my nails done because I leave in a couple hours. I hope you guys enjoyed this pack with me video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and let me know down in the comments so that next time I go on vacation, I can do another one of these or I can do like a travel essentials video. Um, yeah, make sure to subscribe because I will be posting a Las, La Las Vegas vlog for this weekend. And I have so many videos planned. Um, yeah, and I love you guys. Make sure to follow me on my Instagram because that's like my only social account and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.